Hi. Um, I just wanted to talk about, um, as we know him in America, Kashmir Pulaski, but um, as a Polish Polish person, as like as because my family is Polish, I know him as Kazimierz Pulaski, and um, yesterday was his birthday, March sixth. I don't know what year he was born, but, um, and today we had school off because it's Pulaski Day. And, um, I'm a little angry, not angry, just frustrated that, um, there's so much, like, worry about what's politically correct or whatever in this country now that, like, I feel like we're changing things that shouldn't be changed. Like, all of a sudden, this year I noticed that they stopped, at least in our school calendar, they didn't put Pulaski Day anymore, they have it now written as an institute day. And I just feel like, you know, we know that there's school off, and like when we have school off for Lincoln's birthday, we know why. And we have school off for this day, and not a lot of people know why. Um, and I just thought it was important because, yes, he was Polish, but he he was a he was very much so like not only a Polish hero but also an American hero. Um, he um he was very very um actually I don't know if his birthday is today or tomorrow, but I'm not sure to yeah here yesterday. But, um, he was very, uh, prominent in Polish, like, po the Polish, um, army. Um, he, he was a very important and, uh, forceful, and, um, I don't know, what's the word? Uh, influential, whatever. He, successful, um, commander of Polish forces, um, very successful in a lot of battles, and, um, he, um, very, very good organizer, and he was accused of being, um, an organizer of, um, taking hostage of the Polish king at the time, which was, like, Stanik Stanisław Augustrugi or something, and um, so they wanted to, I think, kill him. So he tried to f like flee the country, but no, no like country in Europe wanted to take him. So um, he Benjamin Franklin essentially recruited him to America and said that he should be in our armies. And so, um, and so he started to fight in, he started to work to fight for, um, American freedom in the American, uh, Revolutionary War. Because that was essentially what he did in Poland. He was, he was a true fighter of his country's freedom. And, um, and so, you know, he fought in a lot of battles in America, and, um, I think he worked his way up, and he eventually became a general of either the American Continental Army or, like, one of the divisions of that or something. And, um... They actually called him the father of the the father of the American cavalry because he was just he was so prominent and you know he really he really got done what he wanted to get done he was very successful I just so the bravery and the initiative and I just wow I admire him so much and like it's it, it's America it's not even his his country you know his homeland and he's fighting for it that's how much he believed in people's freedom and um, anyways I just he's 
um, an amazing man. And so, um, he finally died at some battle in, um, I don't want to say Savannah, Georgia, because I know that's where he was buried. But, um, he finally died at a battle, and, um, Uh, you may or may not have, um, he may or may not have been, I can't remember, um, shipped back to Poland and buried there, or buried at sea, but I know for sure that they made it like an honorary memorial burial place for him in Savannah, Georgia, and... There's a monument, statue, whatever you want to call it, for him. Basically, he was just a very, very brave man, very powerful man, very successful. Like, the bravery that this man, like, displayed is just so admirable. And I think that it's important for all, like, all of Americans to know, because he was really important in the American Revolutionary War. And that was, you know, he helped us a lot to um, fight for our freedom. So anyways, yeah, very important guy. A lot of more Americans should know and should be informed. Shouldn't be so, I'm not, I'm not even going to say anything here, but um, yeah, we should, we should definitely give him a lot more credit than I think he gets. It's not as, um, it's, I think it's a less, it's an underrated holiday. But yeah. Anyways, that's all. Talk to you later. Bye.